Settle down. Settle down. In celebration of Earth Day, the Vancouver Aquarium is holding its annual Goodbye Salmon Fry release program, hoping to get some much needed salmon back into the BC ecosystem. The salmon is such an important part of, of uh, life here in British Columbia on so many levels, and, and just allowing mostly urban people the chance to connect with something that they may not see all that often is certainly, we feel, a very important part of our mission and our mandate here at the Aquarium. We're going to be going into the wilderness here in Stanley Park around the corner to check out what a salmon forest looks like. Watch out for grizzlies. <laughs> we wanted to release a salmon. I did this in elementary school, so it's good to do it again. <laughs> this is the eighth year, eighth annual year of Goodbye Salmon Fry. It is still in its relative infancy in terms of salmon release programs, however, we're going pretty good. <laughs> On this day, 24th of April at the BC Hydro Salmon Stream Project in Stanley Park, the salmon fry named, and you put the name of your fry, started its journey to the ocean with the help of you. At the aquarium, we certainly try and create emotional connections between the natural environment and, and people, and, and try not to focus on the doom and gloom that, oh, everything's ruined, we're wrecking everything, uh, but to show that if we can create a connection, if people are introduced to things perhaps that they haven't uh, seen before or haven't had the chance to get to know, that's, well, now you care a little bit more about these things because, well, now you've met this animal, you've met this ecosystem, you've met this environment, and you've seen some of the neat things that they can do and or created a connection with them, and, and that way you're more inclined to care about it and do what you can to preserve it and make sure it is there for not only your lifetime, but hopefully the lifetime of your children and your children's children, and you get the rest of that, how that goes. In 2009, 1.3 million salmon made their way back up the Fraser River. That's 11 million less than expected and 38 million less than a century ago. While commercial fisheries are believed to take more than half of the salmon population out of the river every year, programs like Goodbye Salmon Fry are at least taking a step in the right direction. This has been Tamar Kozlov in Vancouver.